the guy touches and what it means. Hi, hello, it's Anne. Guys, let me know if I'm wrong. Ladies, pay attention. Let's go. First, this is a disclaimer. I understand that that was probably not the best way to introduce this video. But you're already here, so. One, sis, if he touches your face, he wants to get to know you. Two, if he touches your hair, he finds you attractive. Three, if he touches your hands comfortably, he likes you. Four, if he touches your legs or your hips, he wants you. And five, if he touches your back, it shows he's extremely protective of you. Guys, I wish girls knew. Hi, hello, it's Anne. Guys, let me know if I'm wrong. Ladies, pay attention. Let's go. One, hard to get is not fun. Two, once he falls for you, bro, it's game over. It's gonna be hard for him to get over you. And three, video games are used for him to escape reality, especially when he's really, really sad or stressed. And bonus, he's trying to act like he doesn't care when in reality he cares too much. Guys, let me know. Bro code. Hi, hello, it's Anne. Guys, let me know if I'm wrong. Ladies, pay attention. Let's go. One, X's are off limits. Two, whatever you say or do in the chat stays in the chat. Three, when a bro is trying to get another girl's attention, it is your job to roast the hell out of him. And bonus, don't forget to kiss the homies goodnight. Truth about having a girl best friend. Hi, hello, it's Anne. Let's go. One, we make really, really good wing women. However, Two, we always have a strong opinion on the girls that you try to date. It's just our way of being protective. Three, your future girlfriend will most likely hate your girl best friend. Bonus, other guys are going to ask for your permission if he can hit on your girl best friend because they just automatically assume that you guys are together or it's complicated. It's weird. Couple text messages you can send him that will literally make his heart skip a beat. Hi, hello, it's Anne. Guys, let me know if I'm wrong. Ladies, pay attention. Let's go. Disclaimer, the power is in the emojis. One, if you guys are teasing each other back and forth, send him one of these. Two, if you send him one of these, he's going to freak out. He's going to try and respond as if he's not all that excited, kind of like, ooh, sure, why not? But sis, his heart, it's beating out of his chest. And three, this one's extremely simple, but like, seriously? Wait, you say you don't like her and you think that she's annoying, but weren't you just hanging out with her yesterday? And wasn't that you on her Instagram post hyping her up? His attention through text. Hi, hello, it's Ann. Guys, let me know if I'm wrong. Ladies, pay attention. Let's go. One, compliment and ask. So example, I like your jacket. Where'd you get it? Guys love compliments. And there's a question that he can answer. Two, this is kind of weird, but if you text him, use his name. Why? Because he'll see his name and he'll subconsciously be engaged. And three, leave him wanting more. If you guys are texting and it's nighttime, instead of trying to text him throughout the night, chances are he's going to fall asleep and then you may not hear from him the next day. By saying, good night, I'll talk to you tomorrow. Because that implies a good morning message, which then continues the conversation the next day. Truths about guys that us ladies need to understand. Hi, hello, it's Anne. Guys, let me know if I'm wrong. Ladies, pay attention. Let's go. One, they love their alone time. It has nothing to do with us. They're not in a bad mood. It's the same thing with them not wanting to talk and they're just quiet. Most of the time, if not all the time, there's really nothing wrong. Two, sis, if you are wondering if he likes you, he literally does not reply to you like ever. And I understand that they can be busy, but if they don't tell you and let you know, oh, sorry, I was busy, they just, it's, they don't like you. They are not interested. And three, him and his boys do acknowledge the beauty of another girl. If you ask him, he's going to deny it. And I know that's probably something you don't really want to hear. But what you need to understand is that just because he acknowledges another girl's beauty doesn't mean that he has feelings for her. Just saying. And bonus, guys, do not take hints. If you normally get mad at him and expect him to understand why without actually telling him why, he is going to get mad annoyed. Come direct and just let him know what made you upset. He replies almost all guys love. Hi, hello, it's Anne. Guys, please let me know if I'm wrong and ladies, pay attention. Let's go. One, if they ask you how you are, sis, all you gotta do is just say, better now. Two, you ask him what he's doing and most of the time they're gonna say nothing much. What about you? At that point, you reply with, getting ready. I'll see you in 20. And three, if they tease you in any way, you can either keep it simple and just be like, shut up, dummy. Or you can be bold and be like, you like me, huh? Guys, let me know. Three replies almost all girls love. Hi, hello, it's Anne. Ladies, let me know. Guys, pay attention. Let's go. One, if you ask him what he's doing today and he replies with, well, it depends. What are you doing? Two, if you tease him, flirting a little bit, and he replies with, you're cute for that. And three, it's when she asks him, oh, when am I going to see you next? When are we going to hang out? He can either reply with, all right, bet I'll see you in 20. Or he can be bold and be like, oh, you miss me, huh? <laughs> Ladies, please let me know. Logical facts about crushes. Hi, hello, it's Anne. Let's go. One, people tend to get into deeper conversations at night because they're so tired, which causes them to open up more. Two, the more you talk about that person to other people, the more you fall for that person. 
And three, the more you try to suppress your feelings for someone, the more you actually start to feel for them.